Ang landi ko. But I love it. <laughs> Ang plastic ko. But I love it. <laughs> Ang ganda ko. And I love it. <laughs> Yuck. Nayayak ako sa tawa ko, hindi dun sa mga sinabi ko. So, welcome back to another video in which I will teach you how to doggy. Teach me how to doggy. Teach me, teach me how to doggy. Eh, buddy, eh, 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 buddy, eh. Teach me how to doggy. Teach me, teach me how to doggy. Eh, buddy, eh, eh, buddy, eh. Yeah, that is one of the trends I love the most. 2000s, yes! I loved it. So yeah, I'm going to teach you to embrace the parts of yourself that other people don't love. We are all flawed. We are hindi tayo perfect. So if you ever you see pictures of people like Kendall Jenner, Kylie Jenner, Kourtney Kardashian, Kim Kardashian West, I'm Chloe Kardashian, Chris Jenner, Bella Hadid, hi, I'm Gigi Hadid. Like, if you see models that look perfect, <laughs> Honey, you've been tricked because that <laughs> they aren't perfect. They still are perfect. There's no way they're perfect. Pero you know we are wired to think that since they are the beauty standards, they are what we see in magazines, what we see in social media, what is. You know, most like photo, most you know, pinamaray followers IG. We are convinced that oh my god, she's so perfect. I wanna be just like her. Then you know, tinatago natin yung parts of ourselves that is not considered beautiful, not considered. You know, Kylie. That's not so Kylie. That's not so Kim. That is so not Courtney. That is so not Chloe-ish. Hi guys, but please be reminded that those people are rich and they have a history of photoshopping photos. No shade and no anger, no hatred toward the Kardashian Jenner family. But yeah, I am well aware of their history with Photoshop photos so yeah i just want to put it up there that they're rich and privileged enough to photoshop pictures to get professional surgeons to do their surgeries and it is no lie that you know they had a history with cosmetic surgery and there's nothing wrong with that but if you compare yourself and you've had no cosmetic surgery you're not rich nor privileged to a person that is you're you're not going to get anywhere you're just feeling secure and anxious and depressed and your self-esteem will just be like you know <laughs> shrinking down and down and down and down and down and down and down so we don't want that so how do we embrace the things that isn't the current beauty standards it's easy we don't give a fuck about the current beauty standards because like we are beautiful in our own ways I'm beautiful in my own way you're beautiful in your own way Kylie Jenner is beautiful in her own way Beyonce is beautiful in her own way Lizzo is beautiful in her own way. Ariana Grande is beautiful in her own way. So why am I comparing? So why are you comparing yourself to others when you are beautiful in your own way? Because that is what social media wants you to do, to compare yourself. Because this is it, you guys. This is the formula of being perfect. This is a picture of Kendall Jenner. And if you could just be like her for, you know, 
if you could just copy, you know, qualities of her body, her height, her face, you will be considered perfect. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, you wanna be perfect? <laughs> be like Kendall Jenner. Yes, honey. No, yeah, that is what the social media is doing. And they're making money off of it <laughs> Because you know the more we scroll to social media the more we compare ourselves the more we post and post and post to prove that ha, 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 I can look like Kendall Jenner I, You know, I may not look like Kendall Jenner, but I have this big fat ass, you know, we come we put things out there we create an image that is perceived as beautiful and perfect when you know it is not. Ako, I'm not proud of it, but when all the things I upload in social, hindi naman all, pero kapag kita talaga yung katawan ko, such as my tummy, I stuck it in to look good, for it to look good in a photo. Because I don't know how to Photoshop, plus I don't want to be body shamed, plus fat is so not in right like being fat is the most horrible thing in the world like being single no it, parang na wired lang yung utak ko na if you're fat if you look fat in a photo no one will like it no one will like you no one no one no one is going to like your fucking photo no likes no shares no heart you're not in, so shut the fuck up. So, parang ganun lang yung mangyayari sa'yo. Na, ay, yes, I look fat. So, yun, parang mabab it's either mababody shame ka. Because you don't love that part of yourself. So, kung hindi ka man babody shame ng iba, you will body shame yourself. Because, yeah. That is life and that is truth. So, in conclusion, social, the things you see in social media, they are fake. Fake talaga siya. Because me, myself, I'm faking the things that I upload so that it looks good. Yes, I tuck my stomach in. Duh! And a lot of people also, yes, a lot of people do do it. They tuck their stomachs in. Also, models, they stuff. They tuck their stomachs.